Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, welcome to you as well. My name is Jennifer, it's my birthday, and this is my channel. So I wanted to share with you guys what I did for my birthday and what I got for my birthday. This isn't going to be like a gift haul. There is going to be a couple things that I did get as a gift, but it's not going to be like showing bunches of gifts. I do have some gifts that I was sent that came after I made the video of my gift haul that you guys have sent me. So I'm going to make a separate video for that tomorrow and you'll see that probably on Monday. But I just wanted to show you these things that what I got and I didn't want to take away the importance of what other people got and cram it all into one video. So today was a really good day and my cousin wanted to know what I wanted to do if I wanted to go anywhere or do anything. And when you get to be my age, there's not I mean, at least for me, there's not a lot that I want to do. I'm, as I've told you guys before, I'm a pretty boring person. And my idea of a good time is going to Walmart and go shopping. So that is exactly what we did. Um, we went out for breakfast, and then we went to Walmart, we went to Aldi's, went to the pet store. Um, I think that's it. I did go into Target, but I didn't get anything at Target. Um, I'm just not a Target fan. I'm more of a Walmart girl. So, first, I will insert a clip here in a couple seconds. I got a fish tank. So somebody here was selling a fish tank because they needed money. It's just a very small, as you'll see, it's like a three gallon, I think. I think a three gallon or two gallon. I don't know, it's a very small one. And I decided to set it up and my cousin told me that she would buy my fish and all my accessories for it, what didn't come with it, and that would be my birthday gift. So I'm going to insert a picture here, or a clip here, of my new fish tank. I'm still waiting on the filter. I ordered it on Amazon and it'll be here tomorrow. So here is my new fish tank. So that is courtesy of the fish tank I bought and then the fish are courtesy of my cousin as a gift and she also bought me the gravel, a starter kit and different accessories for the fish tank so that was really nice of her and I love it. Um, I don't know if I'm going to keep the fish where they're at. I have them in my kitchen on my bar right now but I may move them to my bedroom as soon as I clean off the table and find room for it. But for now that's its little home. Then um, we went to Aldi's because I was looking for the no carb bread. Our Aldi's is out, completely out, and they don't know if they will be getting it back in or when they will get it back in. Um, even though the website says that it's going to be restocked, there's no guarantee because they're in different zones, she explained. I don't know what that means, but... So I don't know if I'm ever going to get to taste the no carb bread or not. So that was like a kind of strikeout, except at all these my cousin did get me two more gifts and this is not keto and I'm sure I've kicked myself while um, drinking this so it's okay though because it's my birthday and I rarely drink as you can see the cork I didn't have a corks a bottle opener and me and my neighbor pried the cork out with a screwdriver so there's that. Um, my cousin got me two bottles of wine to enjoy for my birthday. And me and my neighbor, we both had two glasses so far. And I'm drinking my third glass. And this is she, this is the first one she got me. And it's Winking Owl California Moscato. She drinks this and she says it's wonderful. And she is quite right. This is delicious. The best wine. I'm not a wine connoisseur because I'm not a drinker, but this is the wines that I have tasted before. This is the best wine ever. And then she also got me this one. It's also the Winking Owl, and this is California Shiraz. I don't know if that's how you say it. It's S-H-I-R-A-Z. So those are the two wines that I got at Aldi's. And I'm not going to be opening the red wine right now. Probably at Thanksgiving time is when I'll have that. But 
I am enjoying a few glasses of wine on my birthday. Alright, so let's move into what I got at Walmart. I got a few new keto finds that I've never had before. One of them I've never a couple of them I've never heard of before. And some of this stuff is not for me. I am have well there I'm not having it, but there's going to be a Halloween party and I've decided all week I'm going to celebrate Halloween. I love Halloween. As you can see, I'm going to be a black cat. And I did wear my kitty ears today. And I'm just that kind of a person. Um so Halloween party. I've decided that all week I'm going to make treats for people that live in my building and for my manager and the maintenance and those kind of people. So first of all, well, I'll just show you. I'm not going to tell you. Um, for some of the treats on Halloween for the part, all right, take two. We're going to give back to somebody came to my door to wish me a happy birthday and give me a gift. So we're going to start again. I don't remember exactly where I left off, but I was telling you about, I'm going to show you what I got at Walmart. A lot of this stuff is not for me. I've decided that I'm going to... Now my cat is walking around. So as I said, a lot of this stuff, not a lot, some of this stuff is not for me. I've decided that I'm going to bake this week and give out treats all week because I love Halloween. As you see, I'm going to be a black cat for Halloween for our party and I will have some clips of that and video. Um, so I'm going to show you some of the non-food items that I got for the party and then some of the food items of the different things I'm going to make all week. I'm going to give them to the staff here and different residents. The good part is a lot of the stuff I'm not going to be able to eat anyhow. Even if I wanted to cheat, I could, can't because my mouth hurts and I'm just not able to eat the stuff. So I'm safe that way. So let's get into what I did get. First of all, I got four dozen eggs because I've been using a lot of eggs for my chaffles. I'm trying to make bulk like triple or quadruple the recipes so I can freeze them and then when I need them pull them out and just pop them in the toaster makes it a lot easier and quicker that way since I found the recipe that the ones that taste like bread are amazing so that's what I did so I got a box of these to give out I know some people don't like candy or if they're diabetic and can't eat candy for whatever reason I got a box of the Halloween pretzels. I also got a box of the trick-or-treat Oreo cookie packs. I don't know exactly how many people I'm going to prepare for. Um, probably 25 to 30 for the party. Um, and then there's more people during the week to just random people to give stuff out to. I did get some candy, but I kept the candy at my neighbor's apartment because I don't want to be tempted to eat it so it's safe I can't show you that but I got bags of like candy bars hard candy all that kind of stuff then I got party napkins I got the pumpkin and candy and these are going to be the bags that I fill up with the candy that I got treat bags I got, I'm going to make cupcakes, and I got Halloween sprinkles for the top of the pumpkin, not pumpkin, but just for the top of the cupcakes. I got pumpkin cupcake liners, and then for the overflow of candy and the cookies and pretzels, I got a little bucket to fill up to put the treats in. I'm going to be taking quite frequent water breaks because when my mouth gets dry, that's when my mouth hurts more. So I have to keep my mouth kind of moist. I got a bottle of black nail polish to go with my black kitty cat costume. I got, this is just for me, I got a container of guacamole. I haven't had guacamole in forever. And I'm going to use this with my, my chaffles. I'm going to make a couple that are really crisp so they'll kind of like a chip and use these for for that for my guacamole. I got this 
I've never seen this before and I saw it at Walmart. It's the Mocha Collection Salted Caramel Mocha or the McCafe Coffee. For me, for my Halloween treat, I got some sugar-free candy. I got a bag of the caramel filled Hershey's chocolates. I got, I've never seen this one before. It's the Russell Stover's sugar-free almond, crunchy almonds in chocolate candy. I got icing for my cupcakes. I got a chocolate frosting, vanilla, and another vanilla. I got a jar of the Crazy Richards 100% Peanuts Creamy Peanut Butter because Miss Terry, one of my friends and subscribers, she showed a peanut butter and jelly truffle that she had. So I'm going to have some peanut butter and jelly truffles in my future. Oh, here's another bag of the sugar-free candy. This is just the dark chocolate, special dark chocolate sugar-free. By Hershey's. I got a new container of baking powder. Some of the turkey sausage sticks. This is one of the bags of candy that I got for the party. It is the Choli. I think that's how you say it. It has sour bright crawlers, extreme sour bites, nerds. Sour gummies, sweet tarts, and lemon heads. And that will be going to my neighbor's house to live as well when I'm done here. I got a jar of the Smucker Sugar Free Strawberry Preserves to go with my peanut butter and jelly chocolates. I got two packages of the turkey bacon. I got these to offset the printed Halloween napkins. I got black and orange. Here's another of the caramel filled sugar free chocolate. Two yellow cake mixes to make my cupcakes with. I got three of these foil pans to take the cupcakes in to put them in so I can carry them easier. Oil. Oil for the cupcakes. I got a package of pepperoni. Two packages of pepperoni. A package of the sharp cheddar cheese sticks. A package of the Pepper Jack cheese sticks. I got a two roll pack of cinnamon rolls. I'm gonna make these either Monday morning or Tuesday morning to take to the people that work in the building as a Halloween treat. Um, either Monday or Tuesday. Maybe Monday because make Monday a little bit brighter having a little treat for everybody on Monday morning. I got a head of lettuce. I'm having a mountain of stuff over here. I 
I got a package of the already shredded zucchini noodles. And I got this for the very first time to try the Pasta Zero Spaghetti. It is the shaped shirataki noodles. And I think these are carb free. Oh, there's three net carbs per serving, 15 calories. So I'm gonna try these. I've heard mixed reviews. Some people like them, some people don't. There's two servings for the bag, so the whole bag would have six net carbs, but I don't think I'll eat them because I don't know what they'll taste like, so we're gonna see. I will show you guys when I eat these. We'll try them together. Another party supply paper plates. These are two new finds. I've never heard of these, but I was looking through the aisles to see if I could find any keto-friendly foods that I haven't tried. These are cauliflower pizza crusts, and it's by the Cali Flower Foods, California Fresh, low carb, good source of protein. Two cauliflower pizza crusts in here, and two in here. This one is the original Italian, and there is one gram of carb for a third of a pizza. So, only three carbs for a whole pizza. That's not bad. And then I got this one is the red, sweet red pepper. One net carb also per serving. I cannot wait to try these and I'll let you know what I think of them. That's why I got the pepperoni. I got cream cheese to freeze. I got five cream cheeses because like I said, I've been mass producing chaffles to freeze so I can have them on hand. I need a lot of cream cheese for that. I finally found the pasta sauce that a lot of you guys have recommended to me. It's the Rayo's homemade pasta sauce. This is the marinara. This is expensive. Um, so I'm going to use this sparingly. And for this, there is one half cup. There's 90 calories and four grams of carbs. Not bad. A lot less than the pasta sauce that I've been using. So that and then I also got the Rayo's homemade Alfredo sauce and this has a hundred calories for a quarter of a cup and one gram two grams of carbs so I'm looking forward to trying those because a lot of you guys have suggested that my other cake mix I got a devil's food they were out of the Walmart they were there was no chocolate Walmart brand of cake mix on the shelf oddly enough so I got the Betty Crocker. I got this package of coffee. I don't know why it's any different, but it's the Fall Harvest blend. And I was a sucker and I bought it because it was Fall Harvest. So, I don't know. But I'm gonna put this in the freezer because I have a lot of coffee now. But I plan on drinking a lot of coffee, so it will definitely be used, but I'm gonna keep it fresh in the freezer until I am ready to use it. I got these small dessert plates, so if anybody wants to put their cupcake on it. Oh, okay, as I was saying before my avalanche fell, I got these little dessert plates in case anybody wanted to put their cupcake on it with some snacks on the side. I got the Ghost Pumpkin and Black Kitty. I got four. I got two packages of the Great Value Spicy Pork Sausage Patties. I do have pork sausage patties in my fridge, but lately I've been on a chuffle sausage egg and cheese kick and I've been eating a lot of those for my meals one gram of carb for one patty 200 calories love it I've never tried the spicy one so I'm looking forward to that and last but not least I got this cute little pumpkin bag for when I hand out candy during the day on Halloween I'm going to there's a few of us that are going to be in the lobby and hand out little trick-or-treats for people coming and going during the day so that's what this is for so that's my birthday haul I had such a good day I got to spend it with my cousin and my very good dear friend sweet lady across the hall I'm going to go now and spend the rest of my evening with some more friends 
I am so blessed to have so many people, so many of you guys as well, send me gifts. Thank you so much for the messages, the gifts, the well wishes. I appreciate it so very much. And here's to hoping that my 44th trip around the sun is the most amazing yet. I will be back soon with another video and then we'll start uploading more regularly again with my daily weigh-ins and what I eat in a day and we'll get back to on schedule soon. So thank you guys so much and remember I'm going to do another haul of my rest of my birthday gifts that came after I filmed the first one. You guys are amazing. Thank you so much. So I'll see you guys again soon and I hope you guys are having a good weekend. Bye everyone.